Welcome to the first official hunting related, I guess, video of the 2018-2019 season. Currently, I am headed to deer camp right now. I'm going to check a camera that I've had up for a couple weeks because uh, got our first hunt coming up here in about a week and a half and two weekends. Um, that's going to be muzzleloader opener. I'm going to be bow hunting though, so hopefully I can get a uh, deer on the ground. I'll be hunting where, where actually where the camera is. It's at a place we got. A, I got a tripod and it's in the pines, so it's open. The problem here in Georgia is it's so daggum thick here. Uh, at the end of summer, beginning of fall, that you can't bow hunt in the hardwoods unless you're doing a lot of maintenance, cutting down limbs, and trimming lanes and stuff. And you know, I haven't had time to do that. And it's usually just me that goes up here by myself, so it's hard to, you know, spot limbs and figure out which ones I need to cut. So I'm mostly going to be focused on this uh, tri tripod. I put out half a bag of corn to camera out about three weeks ago, give or take, or something like that. Checked it one time after three or four days because I had to go back to camp to pick up a camera and bring it back home. So I got this one camera. It's been sitting there. I haven't checked it in almost two weeks. I had a picture. Uh, I had two decent small though, uh, eight points that were on camera. I had them two nights in a row. And then so it's been there for two weeks. Hopefully they're going to be on it. So I'm going to catch you guys when I get to camp. turkeys out there. Four turkeys. Oh, no, six. There are more coming out of the woods. All right, everyone. I got out the other half bag of corn over the camera, and I had like 3,800 pictures on there. Lots of deer movement. I have had the same. I'll show you some pictures. This uh, picture right here of these two bucks, it's the same two bucks, and I got them coming in every single night since I last checked it, so... They're coming in hard. In the last three nights, I've had this nice looking 10 point, but he's young. Um, I'm scared that so hopefully I can get him to stay in this area, which is where I'm hunting. But if another member here at this club sees him, they might take a shot because he's a good looking 10 pointer. But he looks like he's he looks like he's two years old, but I'm guessing he's three just because of it's still hot it's still summer they're not they haven't put on that weight yet so nice young three-year-old 10 point he looks like he might even have a, a kicker or two i'm not even sure they're still on a night pattern unfortunately so i'm not hopefully they uh they move during the daylight through there some um in the next week or so so i can start hunting them but I got a I got a doe and a fawn that coming in about every morning at about 7 a.m. and uh, pretty regularly at about 6:45 or 7:45, 7 o'clock at night. I might be able to get a doe down. I'm not sure. I don't know if I want to shoot with that fawn. She's just she's almost all of her spots are gone. So pretty good. Um, little trip up here to camp. I only came up here for about an hour. I got to be at work and like two and a half hours so i just came up here to check that camera put out some more corn so thank you guys for watching um i'm pumped for deer season i hope you guys are too i know a bunch of you guys are probably already hunting and maybe even gotten a tag on a deer so hope you do hope you guys have a great season again thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like the video give it a thumbs up comment and of course subscribe i'll be posting a lot of hunting videos this fall because I'm planning on getting out a lot and filming every time I do. So look forward to that and uh, hopefully everyone has a good season. Good luck to everyone. See ya.